Hey everybody, this is Game Freak 10124. Welcome back. Welcome to Let's Play Mario Party 2. Just like with the first game, it's gonna be quite a while before I do anything else with this game besides maybe one more board, depending on what we get revealed for the last two boards we currently don't know about that are going to be remade in Mario Party Superstars, but this video and the videos to follow are going to be stupid crap not letting me get through it. Of course. As you guys already know, and I apologize for the semi-awkward commentary, um, Space Land. As of right now, we're confirmed, we know for a fact, Peach's birthday cake from the first game, Space Land from this game, and what he was from Mario Party 3 are being brought back in Mario Party Superstars. Oh, crap, get out of this. But yeah, I'm going to briefly explore the menus in like the beginning part of Mario Party 2, but then get right into Space Land not too long after. And just like Mar the first Mario Party, I eventually want to get through playing up, get to playing through all the boards. But for now, it's just going to be about Space Land because that's the only confirmed board right now we know about being brought back in Mario Party Superstars. I don't know if this will be repeated or not. I imagine it will, but in case it's not, I'm gonna go ahead and do the toad voice. Oh, greetings and welcome to Mario Land! Now that's your destination! Okay. 
Okay, so... Mini game land... Options... Presser computer... Sound machine... Learn about the rules of Mario Party 2. Say a pirate land, cluster land, leaf land, mystery land, and horror land. I guess right now the only options are medium land, the boards, and option lab, and that's it. So, to talk about, I'm really gonna get straight into Mr. Er, Space Land, rather. Become a member of the Space Patrol and keep the galaxy safe. Okay. Well then, we're off to Space Land. This is much better than the first game, because the first game I could see that potentially being a seizure thing for people with how that green was for the mini or for the board game select uh, screen and all the settings for it. Interest oh wait. No, I only have one controller connected right now though. So apparently in Mario Party 2, all options are available regardless of how many, how many controllers you have connected. I don't know for sure since I'm obviously playing this on Wii U for the console. <clears throat> now, I'm curious about the turns. Is it the same turn options as Mario Party 1, or is it the same as Mario Party 3, or is it more than the first game, but more limited than Mario Party 3? between the fact that Don Kong is not playable in Mario Party 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and I don't think he's in 10 either. Plus there's the whole Donkey Kong and Bowser freaking system, and I think Mario, Mar yeah, Mario Party 5 onward, I will play as Donkey Kong. I kinda hate having Mario and Mario both set this one out, but I'm going to since Luigi and Peach are the ones that have the different voices in the first two games from Mario Party 3 and thereafter. Yeah. Just like with the first Mario Party with um, Peach's birthday cake, I'll be having them be all normal difficulty. Same ex I shouldn't be surprised. Same exact settings as Mario Party 1. So I'll go with 35 turns again and plan on doing 18 in this session and 17 in the next session, but we'll see how this goes. Interesting. Light, standard, and full play. And apparently just like in the first game to unlock the... Uh, 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 unlock the... Unlockable board of the game, you have to play through all the other boards once. Interesting, they actually added the bonus or no bonus in this game. <clears throat> okay.
Real quick, I want to say I apologize that the commentary is too loud over the game uh, audio, which it shouldn't be, or if the game audio is too loud, because I didn't do any test recordings prior to this because I didn't care enough. But I just wanted to get into it. America's Got Talent finale is tonight, and I want to get at least 18 turns in. This is a spin situation! This is a huge space crossover and many spins just pass by here! You should go on the spin control! Your challenge means he needs pizza space! Your objective this time! <laughs> Check the station for Bowser's Black Hole Bowser, Black Hole Bowser Space! He needs space and peaceful place to become a superstar of Space Land! <laughs> Of course I go last. Yeah. And I apologize for any audio overlap between the game capture and my TV. It shouldn't be too bad. Also, yay, Mario Party 2 made the change having the stars on top and coins on the bottom. Yeah. Unless you hack your Wii U the, or, or play through an emulator, this is the only way you can actually put there. This is the only Mario Party game you can actually use a Wii U Pro Controller to play. Because even Mario Party 10 uses the Wii Remote. Monsters over here, you may take coins for you. So where? <clears throat> I apologize for the black sides, but oh well. When I had this on Wii U Virtual Console, there was no way I was gonna get a game cartridge from Mario Party 2 offering me if it just did not have black on the sides of the screen. Let me go to the board. Okay, so how the frick do you get to the star? Okay, junction. I'm doing what I should have done in Mario Party 1 with Peach's birthday cake and take a good overlook of the entire board. I think this is brought back from Mario Party 1. Yeah! Yes, I seen it played when having Mario Party 1 up for grinding. Speaking of, I need to check and see how my current grinding session is going. Right now it's in the middle of Shy Guy Says. Leaning quality rope spins and spins. Jump the rope without touching Potaboo. <clears throat> the rope can suddenly speed up or slow down. Watch the flame to avoid the heat. Stops at 20 in the Mario Party 1, but in this game he keeps going to ever 
until one person wins, or if the last two people get burned, then um, it's a draw. But yeah, interesting. Mario Party One is 20 turns, and who if all players that survive the entire time win, but it's until so either one person is the winner or it's a draw in this version. Also, Mario Party 1 didn't have the taunting they added in this game. This is one heck of an epic soundtrack. Yeah, this is also included from Mario Party 1. Voting Isles Under Fire again, this time from Bowser's Bombs. Hang on tight, we we'll win the prize. Interesting. So it's the same game, but it is... There is a slight differentiation. Not how the game is played, but at least something with it in general. Just as time is running out, you'll find Bowser's ship has saved its best shot for last. Watch out. This soundtrack is so epic, it could it sounds like a soundtrack that would be in Mario Galaxy 1 or 2. As long as Yoshi doesn't win the minigame, he can't afford the star. Mega Marathon. I'll create this one. At least it's normal AI. A B. Press A B button simultaneously to wind your mecha fly guy. Interesting, they all have their own color. Come on, that's bullcrap. That is bullcrap. Stupid Luigi. shops in this game, you can only have uh, one item in your inventory. At least you can use it on your own and it's not just you land on the space and either get screwed over on the next turn or freaking keep moving on the same turn. Also, I just realized medium settings, yes, message speed. Normal's fine for this one. Save, save after every turn. Speaking of, I need to check Mario Party 1. Uh, come on. Second time I went to check in, it's in the middle of the mini.
Yeah, I can't afford a frickin' item. Stupid Luigi. Come on, why does that have to be in the middle of chance time? Characters are milling about whoever is the right when the whole call comes wins. Uh, sigh. One, two... Good lord, this game sucks! Like, this seriously sucks. There's too many toes to bother trying to count! This game is horrible! This game sucks. I get... Like seriously, that game sucks. I imagine it didn't, but I hope that game doesn't return to Mario Party Superstars. That game is stupid. Make Luigi pay 10. Holy crap, a mushroom has 10 coins in this game? Interesting, they sniff it design in this game is Mario Party or is Mario 64. I really have to wonder is Mario Party 3's sniff it the first time sniff it's look like what they do in Mar Mario games after that game? Good. Crazy Cutters, Mario Party 1 bring back. Use your jackhammer to cut around the fossilized figures. The cleanest Crazy Cutter wins. Good. Not how it is in Mario Party 1. It's how the original game should have been. The whole point is to cut as close to the line as possible. Cut carefully. Watch freaking Luigi win again. Yoshi won. Oh no, I did. Also, yay, they had the gamepad have Donkey Kong 64 fever. Freaking vibrate. The gamepad vibrates too. Let me get that coin star lead. Honeycomb Havoc. Oh, I know what this one is. This is brought back in the top 100. Yeah! It's, like it takes, it's a luck-based game. Not the first to avoid the bees. Quick calculation will keep you from trouble. Well, it, you can control, you can only control what there is on the dice block rolls. Whether or not you get screwed can be the, uh, yeah! What? 
obviously, if you're not going to screw yourself into getting a honeycomb, you want to roll a two. But the AI's dumb. Bye, Luigi. There you go, she have a coin. I, would, I, I get past this next one no matter what. Enjoy your coin, Yoshi. Bye. I want to go for... Oh, actually, I get the coin regardless. You can't screw me over, Peach. I win. Oh, wait, yes, you can. Glad she didn't. If it was hard AI, she would have won. Now with that flashing crap. 